What's up everybody, how you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street Going up against Engraving Vids in this ranked match It was actually just going to be a player match But we couldn't connect, you know We had to go find another way to do it We ended up just searching for the ranked match at the same time And luckily we got each other on the first try But you know I am the Atlanta Falcons And he is the Baltimore Ravens in this game We started off good, man, on defense we got a pick on the first drive, but then we had to, I just punted it. Like, I couldn't do anything on my first drive. And you're going to see throughout this game, he's been throwing it up, throwing the lob up to Torrey Smith or to whoever was on that left side. Because my defense, man, I, I was, I'm trying out something different. Um, my defense, I was really just, I had the safety in the middle of the field and the cornerbacks was in man, he was pressed. And it really wasn't like something that could stop. A, a wide receiver streak, you know what I'm saying? So it was always there. And um, I'm going to just tell y'all now, man. After this game, I am 0-3 against um, other YouTube commentators. Man, I faced Addy Cards in like Madden like 13 or something like that. Back in it was last June, you can see Steven Jackson. This is why I don't need J Jamal Charles or anybody like that. All I need is Steven Jackson, and we'd be good. But I, I faced Addy Cards in like, it was last year in June. I faced Madden Talk a couple weeks back. And this game is actually kind of old. It just took me a while to um, actually edit it because it was type long. The video was type long. I didn't feel like doing it. I didn't have enough time to do it, actually. You know, practice in the summer is always a lot worse. I actually had a couple practices where we actually got in at 10 o'clock in the morning. And I didn't get back home until like 8 o'clock in, in the afternoon. You know what I'm saying? So it's been tiring. Um, so I'm, I'm trying to get back though. We got vacation off this week, and Julio Jones pulling off. He was walking the tightrope all the way down that sideline. He goes and scores a touchdown for us. It's tied up right now, but you can see I just can't get anything with that. Usually, when I throw lobs like that, I really I don't throw them perfect at all. I, I don't throw them always perfect, but he he's getting them always perfect. I was hoping for an interception. Because Desmond Trufant is like the best corner on his team. And you see Stephen Jackson again. This time right up the middle. I, I didn't know he had speed like that. You know what I'm saying? He gets another. It was a long game for a touchdown. And um, we was going in. But I am just want to tell y'all right now. I changed a lot of stuff. I'm going to be changing a lot of stuff on my channel. You know, I already changed the banner. If y'all The channel are if y'all ain't see that yet. Um, it's a number one Madden career on YouTube. And I'm going to be focusing on that for... Um, for whole Madden 25, for for the rest of Madden 25 going into Madden 15, be focusing on that because I don't really see nobody else doing it. I don't feel like uploading the same Ultimate Team and and um you know same Ultimate Team Championship Max and fake pack openings that everybody else be uploading. I don't be feeling like uploading that. So I'm gonna stick to what I do best when I started with with Madden. When I started with Quincy Blunt, it was a great series the first time. If you wanna go look back at it, you can go. Look back, it's definitely a playlist for it, and it was real tough. So I'm going to be going back to that. Uh, I got a lot of good feedback on my last. It was, it was a football life. I actually, had, I actually had three videos before the most recent one I put out. Um, I type changed the thumbnail up for it a little bit, but I'm going back to those as well. I'm gonna try to get like one of those a week, and I'm gonna try to get a YouTube commentator in on it. Like have him have a YouTube commentator have a part in it. Where they, they just say a line or something that I need them to say. You know, I can't make all the voices. And the last one I had, Peter Jaguars doing some big things to him. He's going, I don't know what he's up to right now. And he actually said it took him a while to do it because he has something that he's busy with. But we do get a pick, though. We actually got the safety back there. Thomas Day Crew gets back there and intercepts the ball. So we do get the ball back. We'll be down by seven. And we're trying to score before halftime. You know, we, we did kick the ball first. We're going to receive after. So... Um, I had Peter Jaguars in that last of football life with the Daniel Taylor and Quincy Blunt. And if you didn't notice at the end, it showed some some high school football player with, with Blunt on the back. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what college he's going to right now, but that's all I'm going to say about that. That's just, just in case you didn't notice. And the commentators at his game were saying, oh, it's going to be amazing or something like that. This kid is going to be amazing. But I, I saw what I'm saying about that, man. So look forward to that. You know, if y'all don't know what it is yet, just look forward to it because it's going to be tough. Um, You know, I'm just basically moving into a career. I actually changed my Instagram name. So my Instagram name is Iron, period, 
M A X Z R L L A. I changed my Instagram name, changed my Twitter name. Not even sure if most of y'all knew I had a Twitter because I only got like 30 followers, but you know, I changed it though just to keep y'all updated on it. But you know, it's gonna be tough, man. Look forward to my channel in the future. That Madden 15, especially because they added this new tackling system and the new cameras. Quincy Blunt and Madden 15 is gonna be crazy, or it's gonna be crazy, man. I'm actually having another player. It's gonna be tough, man. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. You should be looking forward to it as also. But let me get into this game, man. I think I'm up right now, 31 to 28, and of course he lobs it over the top because Day Cool is too slow. Luckily, I, I say luckily now, but when we did release him in real life, um. I wasn't type happy with it, but we did end up signing somebody else. And Julio Jones can't hold on to the ball after tiptoeing to the out of bounds line. He got back in. I probably should have just ran out, but I ended up fumbling. So now I fumbled 35 to 31. He has the ball, and he's been doing this all game. Just dropping 30 yards back with Joe Flacco and just launching it deep. And nobody could get the sack. And he throws a nice pass to Dennis Pitta. Somehow he held on to that. He got sandwiched up. And we just trying to win right now. I'm coming up with a new offense right now so I can use it throughout the year for Madden. Madden 15 because I'm tired of just switching. Switching offenses, offenses and stuff like that. I just wanted to have some same thing that I can show y'all on a daily basis because I know that it worked. And it's coming good right now. I actually played a couple more games after this one. And it did end up working a lot. So I think I know what I'm going to stick to right now. And I just got to put it all together. I got a whole bunch of plays for me that's working. And in this game, it is some some of the stuff out of this game that's actually working. So, hold on. This thing is kind of lagging a little bit. I can't even stop it. Like, I'm trying to... Trying to focus on it, but we do throw a pick to Julio. Don't know if that was tight late. But basically, after that pick, he has the ball back, and it's 38 to 31. Basically, man, we're in the fourth quarter. He has the ball. He keeps lobbing these streaks. I, to be honest, but I didn't really. I know, say, I told you. I already told you I lost. But some of y'all might not believe it. But I didn't really take this game as serious as I took that Madden talk game because I didn't really know if engraving was really like some tough Madden player I knew Madden talk was tough because he, he got videos of him blowing people out and they like top 100 top 10 or whatever I wasn't really sure about engraving so I just I took it serious but to a certain extent of serious I don't, the only thing I sent like one nano blitz and it was on a run play I didn't even get a sack for it so um you know I but I lost though, you know, that's the main reason I'm just telling y'all how I was playing this game It was a lot of people in the party I met, they, I got asked like Yo, you got, isn't that Max Boogie with the uh, YouTube channel, something like that I'm like, yeah, that's me With the YouTube channel, I don't know if they subscribed to me or not But we did end up, I was talking to him In the party, so Engraving Man, he's a nice person He got a whole lot of Talks to a whole lot of subs, I guess On a daily basis, be playing the, my team And the I think he played the ultimate team. Uh, I don't know. I think he was he was playing another game after this one. So maybe me and him get a rematch. And I won't allow these deep streaks to happen all game. As you see, I'm starting to pick it off now. True Font making people miss. And we, the game's over, though. Three interceptions for Desmond True Font. I really can't come back right now. It's 45 to 31, so I'll lob it up to Julio. He mosses two people. Couldn't do that during the game though, but at the end when it doesn't matter, we actually get we actually get the catch. But man, this was a fun game to play. Uh, I did lose by 14, but I guess I'ma try to I'm gonna try to play him again because I, I caught him on some will. He, he asked if anybody wanna play him on one of his live streams and I, I sent him sent him a message, you know what I'm saying? So it was pretty tough. Pretty tough game right here. Tory Smith, five catches, almost three hundred yards. Which is pretty amazing. Play of the game was probably like eight plays in the game. You know, what I'm saying? it's just a streak to um, Torrey Smith that usually gets the touchdown. So my defense is all right. Don't don't get fooled. My defense is all right. You know what I'm saying? I just wasn't really calling the right. I didn't feel like switching it up. You know what I'm saying? But look forward to my channel in the future. You can see he only rushed for like four yards right here. But this video is coming to an end. So always remember. In the street we trust, I'm out.